The new lock screens are brilliant in iOS 16, and they link with focus modes to make it even more powerful than it ever was before. Here's a quick guide to how it all works. My lock screen at home is this lovely photo of Mr. Tibbs, my cat, having a bit of an afternoon snooze. It's a very hard life being a cat. But I don't want this as my work lock screen, just my personal one. So I'm going to tap and hold, and then on here at the bottom, I have the option to link with a focus mode. It's really simple. All I do is tap on there and then choose personal. Then I can swipe across to get my work lock screen and do the same process. I'm going to tap on the link focus button and then tap on to work. Now, whenever you change your lock screen to one of these two, it will automatically enable focus mode because those two things are now linked together. But you can actually customize this even further. You can go into the settings app and then tap on to focus. From here, if I go onto the personal focus first of all, you'll notice that the lock screen is now there as one of the presets. But I can also change my home screen layout. That means I can toggle on or off certain home screen pages, and I can set my own watch face as well. If I tap on the Apple Watch Face Gallery, it will show me all the ones that I've made, and I can choose my personal one to switch over when I get home. Obviously, this works for the work focus as well, so if I tap onto there next, I can choose my work home screen layout and my work Apple Watch Face. With all of this set up, every time I change my focus modes, my watch, my lock screen, and my home screen will all change. Let's try it really quickly now by switching into my personal focus mode. And you can see straight away the wallpaper has changed. If I go onto the lock screen, I get the lovely Mr. Tibbs back again. And then when I go into work mode, I get the weather. And when I swipe up, I get my custom home screen.